Hello, Joe here. In July of 2024, on a very warm, nice July day, my wife, my dog, and my son took a ride out to October Mountain State Forest. A couple years ago, we were out this way in Western Mass. It's a two and a half hour drive for us. We were out this way visiting a friend of ours who was there visiting his family, uh, and we found some roads to try, but we ran out of time. So in October Mountain State Forest, it's the only place that I can find that has unmaintained roads listed on a map in Massachusetts. Vermont, New Hampshire, plenty of them, hard to find in Mass. There are some, but they're hard to find. But here we have unmaintained roads and also dirt roads listed in poor conditions. I'll talk more about these state, state forest maps later, but we headed out there and here's what we found. The roads out here are going to be pretty familiar to anyone who's ever done much off-pavement time in New England. They're very similar to roads you'd find in, in Vermont or New Hampshire or other parts of Massachusetts. All these roads kind of have the same feel of once was more traveled and now is way less traveled. This would probably be a pretty cool spot after rainfall or maybe during snow melt with some more uh, action on the stream. Um, and this is also certainly not my best video. Uh, with the, with a, the little guy and the dog, just made for priorities that were more important than fiddling with cameras. I like to like leave a camera someplace and drive by it or get out and film some things from outside. I just didn't really have the opportunity today. I'd like to come back here and try this again with a different car. This is probably doable. Could hug that way and then this way and then come up here. It wouldn't be too bad. This would be trickier. But I think maybe turning around makes more sense because why not? So we did turn around. We headed back out Washington Mountain Road and then we went uh, up. Um, Roaring Brook Road to uh, Lennox Whitney Road and then back out Shermerhorn Road. Uh, there's some cool waterfalls to check out. Res Farnham Reservoir you can check out. There's some old aqueduct stuff but it says no trespassing near there. Um, cool spots to check out and I had planned this route a while back to visit my friend Matt but um, oddly all these roads are Hanohanic Soft Road so they're not hard to find or secretive. You can just look them up uh, and you can find them on my, this route is on my website which is nothing special but it's there uh, and the links in the description we had a great day it rained a little bit on the way home but that's okay um, it was uh, still just a great day so earlier I had mentioned that uh, this road these roads are fairly unique um, I did look at all the state forests in Massachusetts I think there's 36 33 of them have uh, maps on the state website um, if you look at this one, which is Savoy Mountain State Forest, um, they have a couple of uh, roads that are listed as unpaved and in poor condition. One of them is Old Florida Road, which is a pretty popular four-wheel drive spot and a great spot for a well-built rig. I did it a few years ago. It was a lot of fun. But anyways, uh, these roads, they do exist, um, but you can't fully trust the map. You kind of have to... to do research and go there and see. If you look at this uh, state forest, which is down by Rentham, um, this road right in the middle, Beach Street, um, is listed on the map as uh, unpaved. Uh, if you look at just Street View, it's paved. It's not freshly paved either. It's not like they just did it, and it's paved from end to end. Uh, these maps are a great resource, but they're uh, not perfect, and, and no map is. If you look at this road, which is, uh, sorry, this state forest, which is towards Ipswich, um, Quite a few unpaved roads encounter regular paved roads. And uh, if you look at Street View, the only one I could find that spot. And so on the state forest map, there's no gates. It's just a unpaved road and a regular road. But on Street View, there's a gate clear as day. And I'm sure it's locked um, because this place is meant just for hiking and, and whatever else, non-motorized recreation, I guess you'd call it. Um, so you kind of can't exactly trust the map but you also can't just drive wherever you want either so you kind of have to do your own research and if something if the map says something's right but it doesn't look right maybe you should find someplace else which is tricky to find places to go in mass but there are places if you look hard enough and try hard enough